1970s come alive Through this memory box we've known With country tunes and vintage scenes We'll take you back in time To a simpler place where love and melodies intertwine The concept of playgrounds and backyard swing sets is a relatively new one for American kids. It all started with the Industrial Revolution and the need to counteract the effects of urbanization and poverty on children's lives. By the mid-century, the swing set had become a staple in suburban neighborhoods, offering kids a place to play and have fun. These metal swing sets were popular in the 1950s, 60s, and 70s, featuring swings, slides, and other gymnastics equipment. However, they were prone to rusting and tipping, leading to their replacement with safer and more stable structures in the 90s. The backyard swing sets come in a variety of vibrant colors that mimic the fun of an amusement park. The pony ride swing moves easily with just a slight pressure on the footrests. The swings are equipped with air-cooled seats and strong steel-supported plastic. The lawn swing can accommodate two kids on its steel slat seats. A just published, 1971, study by Consumer Reports magazine shows you can expect children to get almost daily use of swing sets in good weather and that they are most popular with three to seven year olds. Most children playing on sets come to no harm, the magazine survey showed, although some may have suffered minor bumps, bangs, or bruises. However, one out of every 25 of the approximately 750 people questioned reported an injury requiring medical attention. About half the injuries involved a need for stitches. The magazine's report indicates any of the conventional sets could be tilted by a full load of children swinging vigorously in unison, and even if the set doesn't topple, a support could leave the ground and come down cruelly on a foot or a hand. Consumer Reports strongly recommends that assembled sets be anchored to the ground. Vintage metal swing sets often had multiple swings, slides, and other attachments to entertain kids. They were made of durable steel and coated with colorful paint to last outdoors. Some sets even had features like monkey bars, seesaws, and sandboxes for endless play. The designs varied from simple to elaborate, appealing to different preferences. These sets were a staple in backyard playgrounds, providing hours of fun for kids. The Big Slider Gym has an enamel finish and offers three activities, including a nine and a half foot long slide. The shift towards non-metal swing set designs has started in recent years. Jim Dandy brings the fun of Sesame Street to your backyard, attracting the whole neighborhood for playtime.
Pay attention to the small details that ensure the swing set is safe for kids, such as smooth edges and hidden bolts. Look for safe spacing between all moving rides, like Headstrom Safety Ride Spacing. Be cautious of moving parts that could pose a risk to little fingers, but Headstrom's Glide Guard conceals them. Seek out a sturdy American construction with a wide stance that can withstand years of energetic play. And remember, Headstrom has been America's top choice for generations of kids.